Welcome back to Dead Space. We're currently in hydroponics, trying to inject a bunch of Weezers to improve the air quality, because otherwise the entire ship's air is going to be poisoned. Let's head over to the air filtration tower. Just to see what's here. Ooh, can I pick up that flare? Ah, oh, yeah. That's oh, so pretty. What was that? What are these wet noises? Is something trying to hit me? Okay, I don't know what it is, but we seem to be perfectly fine. Oh! Well, there you are! I blew up the flare. That's not what I want. Can I slow you down? Yeah! Okay, we can use that to get past it. I think that's the only way to go. Oh, is that just permanently going to be stasis? Doesn't run out like it does on enemies. Uh, wait, what? Well, that's confusing. Stasis, yes. Schematics? For for what? What was the schematics for?
Something in here, maybe. the electricity producing things. This feels like where I'm supposed to go after I've injected all of the Weezers. But might as well keep exploring. Warning. Thermodynamic purifiers malfunctioning. Stand clear of filtration tubes. Oh my god, look at those. I love all of the industrial machinery. Just the scale of it is awe-inspiring. Oh, I can open the door and go in there. Um... Hmm. God damn it. You got long arms, Isaac. If I run through there, aren't I just going to hit another chamber that's going to also catch on fire? Do these all fire at the same time? Maybe the middle one doesn't go, or it goes at the same time as this one, I can't tell. Uh, we could tell if I was up here, because I really, really need to know. Okay, this one goes. What about the middle one? It doesn't go at the same time. Yeah, maybe it just doesn't go at all. Then the last one. Then I think it's the first one again. Yeah, okay, second one's safe. Here we go. There's a lot of different ways we can go now. Looks like we have a quest objective just right over here. Must be a, a Weezer? Oh yes. Where did they go?
Uh. Are you still alive? Whoa, whoa. I mean, you're making noise. Hello? Jesus Christ. I do not like that noise. God, I love how they just like... Like... Pushes all their flesh off and just leaves them kind of like skinless. It's absolutely disgusting. I love it. That thing is just gonna haunt me forever. Oh my god. Technical manual. This manual is open to a chapter entitled Thermodynamic Purifiers, Maintenance and Upkeep. The notes section has been expanded with... Pulled all the regulators from the purifiers and cranked them up as high as they go. Fucking crazy, but all I can do. It should burn off at least some of the gas. I think? Fuck, I don't know. I have to try anything. Seeing Hidaka puke up her own lungs... Deleted. I can't. They can't be me. Oh god, help us. Thermodynamic purifiers malfunctioning. Stand clear of filtration tubes. I hate it. I hate it so much. Okay, what's what's here? Grow chamber? What is that? Oh, fuck. What are you doing all the way over there? Alright, hold on. Oh, fuck off, ship. You can't scare me. Isaac, please, I need you. Help me. Toxic hazards detected. Another Weezer. Hazardous anomaly. 
Anomaly detected. Quarantine activated. Oh boy. Oh right, you do that. Got it. Quarantine lifted. Toxic hazard detected. I wish I could rotate this thing. It's just not at a good angle to hit the limbs. Put that in with the pumpkins. Ah! Oh, we don't have any stasis. <laughs> that explains why it wasn't working. damage there. Okay, what can we power? Oh, I need a deck systems key card to turn on gravity? No, those would be turning it off. the key card. We've got three nodes for the line gun. Let's go up here and get the damage. Improve the reload time and then damage from 200 to... 225. And then either put something in the flamethrower. So we can increase the duration, which I suppose is going to make enemies burn for longer. Or maybe that makes the firewall last longer. I'm not sure. Hmm. Let's go for the pulse rifle. Let's start to work towards this one up here to uh, greatly increase the rate of fire. So we'll get capacity from 70 to 80.
Can I hit that? That looks like a weak point. I guess I didn't go in here either. Oh no, I did. I thought I was hurting a, hearing a Weezer in here. Maybe they're in here? Maybe they're above us. Yeah, this is where we came from. Yeah. Yeah, they must be above us. Let's head to the elevator. Definitely looks like a weak point. Holt rig. Wait a minute, have we completely looped around? Yeah! I was trying to get Holt's rig earlier, we've looped around. Another piece of the master security override. Okay, for now, let's just follow the marker. We've been in here, haven't we? Yeah, there's dead things. Floor three. What do I feel like something's going to bust out of there as soon as I get that? I'm surprised. Maybe they just wanted to stress me out with the possibility. Lab report to Dr. E. Cross from Professor H. Jaggerwald. Subject organic growth. Elizabeth, as requested, I've attached the latest test results for that organic growth we've observed on the ship. I know you're busy, but we really need to run a joint study with Dr. Howell. This substance is absolutely fascinating. Given its affinity for dead tissue, at first I thought it was some sort of fungus, but the cells most closely resemble bacteria with viral behavior. This organism infects other cells through osmosis, then mutates and reproduces agamogenetically. What's most incredible is the speed at which it grows. One of these bacterium reproduces 20-fold in just one minute. 
that's why we haven't been able to pinpoint any specific origin point, I think. It just seemed to be in multiple points on the ship all at once. I've never seen anything like it. I won't stake my reputation on it, but I think this may be a genuine alien life form. Professor Hawley theorizes that it's a habitat transformer. The levels of gaseous discharge are tremendous, which is why it smells so bad. But to what end? We simply don't know. What organisms might exist symbiotically with it? Are they out there? Could they be sentient, even? I'll keep you posted. Heinrich. Now that we've got the key card, we should be able to use this. Yep, turn off the gravity. Or turn on the gravity? Entering zero gravity. Turning on the anti-grav, I guess is what we're turning on. Sorry that I interrupted that audio log. Didn't mean to. Alright, we're back to the uh, hub room for hydroponics. Let's head down the meat tube. Eject the Leviathan into space. You know what? I don't have much ammunition for the force gun. Still not sure if I want to keep it or not, but anyway, for now I'm going to equip the contact beam. Because I have a lot of ammo for that. Like, a lot. Because it sounds like we're going to encounter a boss pretty soon. Guess what's left? We already failed ejecting it into space. No objective, kill it. Entering zero gravity. 
this is very dark, which tells me it's about to come out of the darkness. Here we go. It's, it's just like, it's right here, isn't it? Oh, man. Oh, the lighting reveal on that is absolutely brilliant. Oh, that is so fucking cool looking. Ah. Oh, they got weak points. Contact beam time. Slow on that one. Oh! Okay. Let's use the special. Ah! I need to charge up the, um, the special. I think I missed. Did I do it? Oh, wow. First try on hard. Oh, that wasn't too bad. Just grab all this loot. Gravity. Air quality's improving. There's still pockets of gas trapped here and there. Here and there, I can handle. Listen, Jacob. My Jacob. Last I heard, he was on the mining deck with some other survivors. He said they were building an SOS beacon. Did they finish it? 
He said it was nearly done, but I haven't heard from him in a while. I can't leave yet. I need to make sure the air is safe to breathe. But if you can find that SOS beacon, call for rescue. I will. Mining deck. Okay, got it. And if I meet Jacob? Tell him. I'll find him. He's all I want to see. An SOS beacon. Someone jettisoned all the others. Isaac, there's a shortcut to the mining deck. Near Cross's workstation. I'll get it open. Goddamn. We might actually get out of this nightmare. Chapter 6 complete. Chapter 7, Into the Void. Well, I think that's a pretty nice place to end the episode, so hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, we're gonna head to the mining deck. <laughs>